Maker Fair, Robot Pooh Bear Bot by Downing Bots. Pooh Bear Bot member HBRC at CMU West. The Pooh Bear Bot has a VEX, two camera, voice box, four, sensor, uh, four sensors, three capacitive sensors, five push sen switches, two microphones, two electromagnets, two accelerometers, two, five servos, actually it's six. Pooh's push train has a Lego RCX, a short range IR, long range IR, two multi, actually three multiplexers, two bolt bumpers, one motion detector, one touch sensor, one ultrasonic sensor, one motor. And then there's Pooh's car seat and car, which is a modified sharper image target bot. Winnie the Pooh singing to you using his that was Pooh knows your name voice box he can hear me talk so that's why he's moving his head right now now if you uh, so he's hearing me on this side and he keeps on talking quite talkative tonight now, if you hold this hand, you will look this. You will look uh, that side. He has four sensors on the arms over here. So let's see what he does when you do that. Oh, he's trying to stand up. Actually, let's see what happens when we try to stand up. He first brings down one leg, then the other leg, and then he tries to stand. He tries to balance. He actually balanced very too easily that time so he's uh, so he's trying to stand. If you just uh, touch his head that'll trigger him to that he should try to walk. So he's trying to walk right now but if you put him in the walker he'll walk himself. Can you Boy, he's talkative today. Okay, let's get him to stand up a little bit. Come on, both hands. Okay. Eight steps. Wild counting. So as you can see, he's walking slowly. Steadily making progress across the table. Very good. Now, Pooh Bear, what happens when I put you down there? Hey, he stopped walking and he's beginning to crawl forward. No wonder he has a dirty nose. Now he's decided to walk backwards a little bit. Now, let's, let's put him back over to this position over again. Of course, when he's all done, he'll wave goodbye. Goodbye. Now you can see over here, he's got a like 
met electromagnets over here in his paws, which uh, will help him actually carry things. Under certain circumstances, he'll start he'll start picking up things that are metal. And this is a nice little metal lunchbox, and with uh, magnets over on the side here. And when he decides to, he'll try to lift things up. I don't know if he's going to do it yet. Okay, next. Next we're going to show Pooh and his push train. Now Pooh's push train is actually an RCX, uh, I mean a Lego RCX Robo Brick. On the front here he has infrared sensors, uh, he's got a distance sensor, a heat sensor, a short range sensors, and bumpers. And if you look at the bottom when I turn this thing on you can see his wheel. Now this wheel will choose which directions to do. So you can listen to it play Winnie the Pooh and it's calibrating to that side. And then it'll straighten it out. When, it, when it's done straightening out, it, he'll, it'll be ready for Pooh to start walking. Now Pooh is slowly walking along and the train will, will slowly and surely detect that there is an uh, obstacle in the, way, in, in the way and push him hopefully around the obstacle very, very slowly. He's running out of batteries. No. Now, uh, Pooh Bear is sometimes too thin, so you can actually blow up his stomach to make it fat him fatter. <laughs> See if I succeeded. Oh, what do you know? There's a little bit of a balloon there. So this is Pooh's car. That way! Okay. <laughs> 